Hi friends, this is Tim Schrock from Design Build Solutions. On today's Tech Tip Tuesday, I'm going to give you a very fast, quick tip on editing lines, the 3D lines, especially in layout plan views. Let's get started. So I'm working on this layout and I'm struggling with uh, getting a really good terrain to, you know, do proper, uh, like a really smooth um, grade change. And it's coming out, as you can see uh, in this elevation, that I've got this really crazy uh, grade line here. And I, I don't want my plan to really look like that. So I'm going to use this Edit Layout Lines tool right here. I don't know how your toolbars are set up. If you don't have this tool on your toolbar, you can go to Tools, Layout, Edit Layout Lines. And there you go. I'm going to delete this one. I clicked on it. And then I'm going to edit this one and say it's going to do like that. Easy as that. You're done. Now, the trick is if you have to update something, let's say you um, change the style of the doors or change the style of the siding or added corner boards or deleted corner boards or what something um, and, and you want to update the layout view because you think of all these changes that you want to do. So I'm going to update the layout view here. Uh, you could do that by uh, the selecting the layout view and updating here or opening this and closing update layout view it didn't go back as before which I'm kind of surprised but it's not quite what we had in in originally so I'm going to do the same edit layout lines and just drag that out I can add a layout line as well Again, if I update layout view, though, it, it's it gone. Let's delete that and update layout lines. It's, so there you go. If I deleted that one and update again, it's back. So that's just something to remember if you do update. If you choose to do layout lines and then update the view, uh, it will go back to its original state. Hey, I hope this has been helpful. Thanks so much for watching. Catch you around next week.